السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته. Today's lesson is about how to change the donut culture. We get to know a very generous businesswoman from Cairo, from Egypt, and she came and visited our office in Albania in 1999 to see what's happening there and to donate some money with a female delegation. And at the end of 1999, it was the second Chechnya war. It was very fierce, very destructive, very devastating. And she promised to give money for Chechnya, okay? While we need desperately money for Bosnia, because Bosnia disappeared from the international media and the international community and from the Haitian world. And we would love to return refugees back to their own villages. And we have discussed this issue in the office in Birmingham, and I was told, go and meet the lady in Cairo to try to convince her to shift it from Chechnya into Bosnia. I structured my meeting with her before I, I planned to visit her, based on respect and evaluate what she's doing it for people globally. Number two is to talk to her nicely and kindly because she is a businesswoman and she is managing thousands of people at my level on higher and less. Number three, to be transparent, honest, and try strategically to shift her strategic thinking from this spot to another spot. Number four, uh, to explain to her the humanitarian dimension of the Bosnian problem, especially how many girls and women have been raped and how many people have been killed and so on. And we're discussing this issue on the dinner table. I told her you are a very wise, strategic woman and you have got a sharp vision and strategic dimension in all your work benefited many, 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 many people in reconstruction as well as in humanitarian work. And Chechnya issue is on the television. Anybody can donate money for Chechnya. But Bosnia issue is not on television. And only need somebody with your ability and your thinking and your strategic direction to understand the dimension of what you can do for the Bosnia problem because it's not on the media. It's disappeared from the media. And want you to enable us to return those returnees back, refugees back to their homeland. She agreed, alhamdulillah, and she donated 500,000 to rebuild the uh, houses in Bosnia, in East Bosnia. Not only that, but the following year, she donated another uh, amount of money, which was her villa in Spain, which, which when we sold it, it was about $250,000. Listen, learn it. First of all, respect. Respect. Be kind. Be transparent. Be honest. Be, trans be, be actually trustworthy in talking to this kind of people because they are very intelligent, super intelligent, and have vision and have strategy and take the burden to travel to meet them where they are, if this is in a different country or a different continent. Third point, remember that your discussion with her or with him is just a discussion, but the decision is in the hand of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala because the money is the money of Allah and the risk, the risk of Allah. Alhamdulillah, she gave us what we can and we managed to change, managed to change uh, her uh, mind and she give us three seven hundred fifty thousand dollars for Bosnia. Salaam alaikum wa rahmatullah.